A group of lawmakers are attempting to update Michigan's laws involving surrogacy. News ace Demetrius Sanders joins us in studio with a look at a series of bills that could bring big changes. Well, Michigan is home to some of the country's most strict surrogacy laws, laws that some are calling outdated and in need of major adjustments. In 1988, the Michigan Surrogate Parenting Act took effect outlawing paid surrogacy and ruling that all surrogacy contracts are unenforceable. This has led to intended parents having to adopt their biological child. Michigan's families have changed a lot in the last 30 years and our law should reflect that. There are so many reasons why a family might have an untraditional route to parentage such as health related issues. Wednesday, a Michigan Judiciary Committee heard testimony on a package of bills that would transform the state's surrogacy laws. This package is about parentage and protecting our families, protecting and dignifying all of Michigan's children, no matter how they were brought into this world. The bills would repeal the Surrogate Parenting Act, replacing it with the 2023 Michigan Family Protection Act, ensuring children born via assisted reproduction or surrogacy can establish legal parentage with the intended parents, decriminalizes surrogacy agreements, and gives children born through surrogacy an opportunity to receive receive a birth certificate. What if your child is born through a surrogate and has to go in the NICU? There is no, absolutely no laws in Michigan that protect that child. Whose health insurance are they under and who are the intended parents? Um, so these are all those little things that we need to fix. One lawmaker on Wednesday did ask questions about the effectiveness of new surrogacy laws. I understand why it'd be good for the children that are actually born into it, but is it something that it, uh, absent unusual circumstances like the ones you described for yourself, of course. Is it something that we want to encourage and why? In response, one legal expert claimed the bills would make all children's rights protected and potentially assist the state. We're keeping um, cases out of court that don't need to be in court, right? If we can establish parentage of a child at the hospital at birth, um, that's really going to save resources um, for the state. Now, this isn't the first time that lawmakers have tried to update Michigan surrogacy laws, but previous attempts didn't make it to the governor's desk. Sue.